welcome back to my channel it's your girl Mia Crystal back with another video so today I'm going to be talking about what's been going on and information on what happened what went down with our Instagram our boutique Instagram and so the real reason is someone, someone hacked our thing and deactivated it so a couple months ago our Instagram started acting very weird like we would post like because us we have to constantly stay active like we can't just like slack and like not post because then that'll just bring us down so we post constantly on instagram and some of our posts were getting deleted and we we're like what the heck like what's going on we we thought it was instagram doing that because i know instagram can be acting some it's bipolar sometimes so yeah so it was doing that and then our stories were getting deleted too so we we're like the hell then I don't know it was just like weird because it was happening constantly and we would had to be on our phones just like staring at it and refreshing it so it doesn't get freaking deleted or like we would have to post it again because we have certain times where we post and um, yeah so that's when we post and sometimes they'll get deleted and we have to repost it and we would even have to save our captions on our freaking notes so it so we don't have to keep on putting the thing and you know because it would happen like three times and then when was it Sunday night it logged us out and deactivated our Instagram so we were like what is going on so then now we don't have an Instagram right now, but we are trying all we can to get our Instagram back because we literally, that's, that's us, that's our life, that's how we work, it's Instagram, and uh, for someone to do that, you really have, you have the nerve to do that, that's so dumb, like what the hell is wrong with you, so that's a has been going on um yeah we just just it's been really weird so now i'm going to be answering the questions that you guys asked me on my personal instagram if you don't have it it'll be right here and in the description so yeah let me get it see me on my instagram these are questions that um i get asked on the daily basis so i just like told everyone to ask me questions business questions on my oh my god that guy is gonna run into the freaking thing um on my instagram so i can make a youtube video so i can just be like go watch this video and you'll get the answer but um yeah so the first question is what inspired you to start your clothing business okay so i was 13 and no i was 12 at the time because yeah I was 12 and um, for Christmas I got money because everyone gets money for Christmas so I decided with that money I need to do something and so I got goodie bags they're called blessing well I call them blessing bags so I would like just hygiene stuff that people need and I'd put them in my mom's um, trunk and just like if we see someone that's unfortunate then we just give it to them because yeah so that's what inspired me because a couple months later I was, I, I was 13 and I was like um, I want to keep doing this because this is like really fun so I need to start selling something so I wanted to sell my own clothes like literally like my old stuff that I don't even use and my mom's like what the hell are you doing like <laughs> no so then um we went to LA and if you don't know what the guy Callejones is Ellie's. So then they have that all the good stuff there, and let me tell you, and cheap stuff. So I would get like chokers and like fur balls, the keychain fur balls, and sell them at school. And I also made an Instagram was Mia's Mia's Boutique. I didn't even think this was gonna blow up, but um, yeah. So it was Mia's Boutique, and for a little bit of time, but then um. People were asking for clothes, and I was just like, oh, okay. So then that's how we started. And then now we're, 
Next question, how does it feel to have a successful business at a young age? It's honestly the best thing ever. Anyone tell you otherwise because they're wrong. And don't ever say you're too young to do something because you're wrong. Okay. Next question, how did you start it and how long did it take? Who helped you? And I want to know. I want to start my own. So how did I start it was by selling keychains and fur balls on Instagram. And how long did it take? To get where I'm at now was three years. But that's because I was like consistent and like not slacking and like uh, you said you wanted to start your own. So if you really want to start your own, then girl, I really recommend it to do it. But like you need to be consistent and like you need to like, that needs to be like your priority. Like you cannot slack off. And, um, who helped you? My mom helped me a lot. And, um, honestly, I did not start with a lot of money. You don't, you do not need a lot of money to start a business. Because I started with a hundred dollars. Crazy, right? So, yeah. Oh, she said, any other advice? Just stay consistent. If that's really what you want to do and want want to, you know, then do it, girl. What's the process like? It's honestly frustrating. No, I'm just kidding. Um, there's like always like times where I just want to quit, but I can't because who would want to quit? Like, um, um, you guys hiring? No, we are not hiring, but maybe in the winter we'll hire. When is your new business launching? Um, hopefully fall, if not winter for sure, because, yeah. Um, if you were to hire, how old would you need to be to apply? Uh, I would say, I would say 18 with the work experience, because honestly, I don't want to just hire someone and they just, just slack because I want someone that's gonna work their butt off I don't want definitely not family members because then that's just and um yeah so 18 and have work experience uh what is a preferred age to hire 18 where is it located it's located um 15 15 19th street Bakersfield, California, 93301. <laughs> How much did you save? I think they meant all, but they put O. For your business. I saved $100. Will you consider collaborating with fashion models for your business in the future? Yes. Yes. Hopefully. In the future. <laughs> love how you're more successful than most adults with your business that is a very amazing compliment that I've ever got but thank you um, that wasn't a question but thanks <laughs> the last question is do you love your business and why I, I do love it it's honestly the best thing I love being my own boss and no one telling you what to do so, if you ever want to be a business owner, I definitely recommend it because you do not want to be working for someone for the rest of your life. So that's it for my video guys. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video and don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel. And Never have to give a rap producer head. I got all these bitches wanting to be Barbie dolls. Barbie dream house, pink and purple marble walls. Pull, pull up.